Now we start to uh, design the movie, uh, sometimes starting from the VFX. So again, VFX are happening before the short. Uh, what's your position about that? Well, I echo the whole fix it in prep. That, that, I think, is the key. If there's one takeaway from this panel that I'd like to do, it's that fix it in prep, fix it in post is an absolute waste of time and money and energy across the planet. Fixing it in prep is the way to go. It's good planning, good um, forcing everybody to be focused, choose the right decisions, make the big decisions, and then literally deliver something. And then, I, I've said this before, but the, the VFX should not become, obviously, if you have an impossible thing like a dinosaur or you know, some impossible creature, that's VFX. VFX should not be used as a crutch. And that's what I find nowadays is people are over, over relying upon that. So basically saying to the entire crew, challenging the crew in pre-production to, to not even put up a blue screen. Just literally make the set the best that you can, make everything the best that you can in the same way that you would have done in the 70s, the 80s, the 90s. Like the fact that there's VFX involved in the process should not become a crutch that everybody falls back upon. So that to me is like the big, the big change that I think the industry needs to make because I think we've got lazy. <laughs> okay. Can I just add a little bit to that? Because, you, know, you know, from what we can see and the way that post is set up and uh, production is set up, the later you make a decision, the more expensive it gets. So if you don't make a good decision in prep or you, you make a mistake in the shoot, the sooner you can catch that along the pro whole process, the cheaper it will be to fix. So that's why having, if, you, if you're making decisions in prep and on the way that you're going to spend your money, it's going to be a more efficient and more cost-effective um, workflow in terms of time and money than if you left it to the last moment. And will look better. Yeah, absolutely. O always, because the, the, the thing, all, all I hear about VFX, generally speaking, is it's expensive and it takes too long. That, that's mostly because they're engaged too late and all of a sudden you have acceleration costs, you've got, on my last picture I had 25 different vendors around the world. So, you mean, you're literally working across the globe and you're, you're doing single shots in different places and just trying to patch everything. It, it's, if you plan things better, there will always be changes. It's yeah, a creative always. process, we, we know that, but there are a lot of things that you can fix.